another one. That's a big one. Baby, yes sir, yes sir, yes sir, oh yes sir, <laughs> that's the kind we're looking for, post bomb Betty, that's you, four pounds, 414, five pounds. Yeah, yes sir, hey, let's get a photo, pretty one here. Awesome. All right, mama, thank you for that. You hit that like you was supposed to. Yes, sir. Two pounds, six ounces. Two six. Dang, that dude's only a six. Two six. He's fat. I ain't gonna argue with the man, though. No. One pound, four ounces, no scoreable. All right, guys. So I left my vlog camera at home, of course. So you guys gotta get the, the GoPro footage. Uh, hopefully the wind's not too bad. But anyways, end of period one, this is day two. Um, we've caught two bass so far. Well, technically we caught one, two, three, four. Uh, we've caught five total. Three non-scoreables little guys. Caught, I had a couple bites flipping. I wanna flip some more today. Um, I think you catch a really big one flipping. I just, you know, it's gonna be more about where, that sort of deal. Um, but nevertheless, we got to make this knockout round. That's first and foremost. So uh, we got 36 pounds right now. I think if we get 40, I'm going to call it 40. If we get 40, I think we'll be safe. Cut weight right now is 22 pounds. And so technically, I'm not that far off. Guys start catching them, get on a, on a roll. Before you know it, they'll they'll be on my tail. So uh, we're going to do our best to make this knockout round so we can have a serious shot at making championship round. That's the plan. So just wanted to check in, give y'all that little tidbit real quick. I'm probably super close to you guys right now, but it's all good. And um, we're gonna keep rolling. All right, see ya. Yes, sir. Okay. Oh, we're going to Gator Bay to have a few beers yeah, and eat buddy. a little bit. Yes, sir. Ain't nothing wrong with that. He ain't going to quite make the cut. <laughs> Do they have a limit on them now? 
They got to be uh, one pound, eight ounces. Oh, okay. He was a pound, six There it is. One pound, three ounces. All right. What it do, YouTube people? Today, we just finished up day two. It's a special day. It was a stressful day. You guys might have watched it on live. Your boy with five minutes to go. Five. Okay, I was in 21st place. I was a one pound, three ounce, which is non-scoreable, but one pound, three ounces outside the cut. I need to catch scoreable bass. Five minutes to go, I catch an exactly a one eight. Not a one seven, not a one nine. One eight. Last man in, I knocked out Randy Howe by five ounces. I apologize, Randy, because I've been on the other side of that bubble. That's the worst feeling ever, bro. As happy as I am to had made the cut, I feel for Randy, because I just know that feeling, man. Anyway, I just wanted to get on here really quick and tell you guys about my day. I really thought I was only gonna need to catch like six, seven, eight pounds based on day one. You usually just double the, as we talked about it, you double the weight. Nah, these boys caught more than 10 pounds over what double that weight was. And so it got real trick. We eased, 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 eased in there. So very happy for that. So now I'm back at the house, hanging out with the boys. We're gonna get in here and have a, an adult soda here momentarily. It's a good day. Got us 10 bands, minimally. Yes, that's always a good feeling. Made the cut, knockout rounds coming up on Tuesday. We got a lot of work to do. We're gonna have to catch them again, somehow, some way. Light's bad right here. Oh, there we are. There she blows. Out here re-rigging. Knockout round tomorrow, so we need to put on some juice. This has been a deal this week for me. Half ounce clear water shad, jackhammer with a razor shad trailer. It's been it. Any surprises there? Probably not. All right, guys. It's knockout round. Here we go. Let me find my. Oh, oh, there it is. That's my good light. I was looking for him. Anyway, knockout round. We are the last guys to go out today because we were the last guy to barely make it in. So today's an important day. Uh, it's a big day. It allows us to have an opportunity to make the top eight and fish championship round, but also it's an opportunity to gain a lot of points. It's all about points in this deal for AOI, of course, to make that Rick, Red Crest Championship at the end of the season. That's what it's all about, making championships. So here we go, getting ready to slide out. Lurch is doing this thing, calling us all off. I got a little bit of time, because I'm last. But, nevertheless, we're getting ready to go try to catch us on. So, stay tuned, rocking the chesty, got my back camera going. You'll see whatever I catch today. Hopefully it's a lot. All right, peace. All right, guys, so we're getting ready to lock through. We're here, uh, I'm not sure what town this is, but this is the lock you gotta go through in order to get to Lake Griffin. So, right now, myself and Timmy Horton, we're the last men to come through. We were late. We were a little bit late. <laughs> they only take nine people uh, per trip in the lock, and so we come through right here, and then she fills it up with water, closes the gate, and then here in a second, you'll see this gate open, and the water will start falling out. Good morning, how are you? And there's the lock master. Kid caught an eight and a half pounder inside the lock. That's, 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 that's pretty dope. 
All right, here we go. So the water level is going down, as you can see. Dropping, 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 dropping. And those gates are gonna open here momentarily. Once we get all the way dropped out, and we gonna slide on through and start fishing. We are about, let's see, lines in was at seven o'clock. It is now 7.24. We've been losing a little bit of fishing time, but that's part of it. Hopefully Lake Griffin's good to us today. We shall see. <laughs> Killed you. Can you pee on a fish line in violation? No. Dude, for sure. Those are fast. Alright folks, end of period one. Woo! Struggle bus. Picking up where we left off, man. We gotta change up. I'm getting ready to try something totally different now. Uh, fished hard, period one. Had one bite. Caught it, fortunately. Hey, it was a 1-8. <laughs> Probably the same one I caught that made us, made us in. But anyways, I'm gonna switch patterns this next period. Just start practicing, trying stuff. Hopefully uh, we can run into them. We need to run into them in a major way. The cut line's at 9-12. We're not terribly far off of it, man. I mean, we can just start catching some bass. That's all we need to do is start getting bit. And we can really make up a lot of ground. But we gotta get these bites in order to make that happen, so. I don't know. We're gonna continue to try to make that happen. That's my, that's my update. All right, guys, so we'll be back in action. I got Chesty on, so if there's any action, you guys will see that. All right, see you in a little bit. Later. Oh my God. One pound, 11 ounces. One pound, 11 ounces. Oh God, dude, dude, I just wanna let you go, buddy. Hey guys, coming to you live and direct from underneath a cedar, no, a cypress, up underneath a cypress tree. Pretty cool cypress tree too, a bunch of knees up on the bank behind us. But anyway, that's the wrap of period two. Uh, we did ourselves some help. We moved off the bottom, the very bottom, and we're now in 33rd. 
we literally just need to catch some fish like just some scoreable bass to continue to move up that leaderboard man and, and we're, we, we ain't but a flurry away from making a shot at the top eight i mean it's dude it's tight you know um and they're not catching them tremendously great but they got a lot more than me i think i only got six pounds right now so a lot of work to do but uh real hot stagnant so i think i think i'm gonna target some shade i'm gonna mess with these schoolers i found some schoolers right here underneath this bridge as i was fishing the outside of it they come up blowing up i was able to catch three of them and now i just can't figure out how to catch them they've came up three four five times since then and i just can't get them suckers to bite nothing so tough deal but uh we're gonna keep after them so see you guys here in a little bit later Oh, bro. Little. Yeah, you ain't gonna make it. Bro. Yes, How about that? Oh, messing with an alligator and then got smoked. Gosh, Lee. Oh, you're good. You don't even know what happened to you, do you? That happened so quick. <laughs> Seven ounces. Seven. Gosh. You got that. Top of the morning, folks. That wraps it up for us. Here's Chain. We out. We did not catch him yesterday. We got beat up pretty bad, but that's the game. We made the cut. That was gut wrenching all by itself, but we made the cut. End up finishing 36th yesterday's group, but two guys didn't compete that won their rounds. Bobby Lane and um, oh gosh, who won the other round? Uh, uh, Brett Height was in. It was in my group. Destroyed him. Anyways, so those two guys didn't fish, so that puts me finishing up the week, 38th place. <clears throat> not a terrible week, <clears throat> excuse me, jeez. Not a terrible week by any stretch of the imagination. Not where we wanted to finish, of course. Uh, made the cut, got a check. That's always a good thing, but man, we're trying to stay high in those AOI points. And so we were in sixth place going into this event. So that's gonna knock us down quite a bit, but uh, we still in it though, that is for sure. So we go to Chickamauga next. We'll be coming to you live and direct from J-Dub's house. We'll be staying at Jacob's crib this week. And uh, that's always a good time. Have the wives and everybody up. Kick back, relax, have a good time. So anyways, hope you guys uh, enjoy the video. Maybe you learned something, maybe you didn't. Maybe you learned from my mistakes. That's the, that's the key here. And uh, we'll be tapping back in at Lake Chickamauga. So thank you guys for all watching. As always, I so greatly appreciate it. Uh, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. You know the you know the drill. See you guys later.